first hearing about Olam IV uh, at a lecture where Dr. Malo was speaking, and as he was going through the features and the, the problems that Olam IV addressed, I, I remember sitting and thinking about my experiences in, in dentistry and implant dentistry in particular, and thinking how he was addressing every problem I had encountered as a practitioner. The, at that moment, it all made sense that this is what I needed to be doing in order to provide the best solutions to my patients. Uh, from a surgical point of view, from a restorative point of view, functional point of view, it, it just made sense. All the problems were, were taken care of in, in one procedure, one protocol. With the OM4 and, and the final prosthetics that, that we deliver, the final bridge, um, one of the things that we aim to do is uh, to undo the changes that have occurred over time. Changes in facial uh, soft tissue support that uh, can affect your smile, creases and lines in the face can be exaggerated by not having the teeth behind the cheeks and the lips uh, supported. When people lose their teeth, uh, the, the body resorbs bone because it wants to be very efficient. Uh, maintaining bone takes energy. So if your body loses a tooth, then it wants to take away the supporting bone because it no longer needs to spend energy on that. And that's at the expense of facial structures. So the bones diminish in volume and that's where the facial structures can seem to collapse over time. By putting back not just teeth, but uh, in, the, in our bridge, we, we build back the, the portion of bone that, was, that is missing. We then can support the tissues in a, in a natural manner and, and give back somebody their, their natural smile. General dentists might be surprised to learn how many patients uh, are in their practice that are excellent candidates for the all 4 procedure. We don't rely on typical volumes of bone and location of bone to make the all 4 work. Uh, we, thanks to uh, the work done by Dr. Malo, we're able to use what little bone is left to its best purpose and, and help us anchor a bridge. Uh, most of these patients m may have been told that there was no chance of placing implants without grafting. And in some cases, uh, some patients have been told that even with grafting, uh, there, there's still minimal uh, options for them. Uh, we can take most of these patients, and whether it's through conventional implants in the on 4 technique or with zygomatic implants, uh, we can treat virtually any patient uh, with implants now.